picture of a leaf, I don't want you to pay attention to the leaf. What I want you to do is pay attention to my sloppy photography, and and look at all the dust that I've uh, that I uh, didn't wipe away before I took the picture. But I'll show you a little technique that I that I have for getting rid of the dust after the fact. What I like to do is always when I begin a uh, uh, a project is always make a duplicate copy of the original layer. That way I've always got the background just in case something happens. Okay, so I've got the uh, the layer, a copy of the layer uh, above the background. Now what I want to do is go into the filters menu and I'm going to go down here to noise and I'm going to use dust and scratches. And what I want to do is target a piece of dust that's on the photograph and this this will do fine just right there and in my preview picture you can see the dust right there and I'm going to increase the radius by one until it disappears and number three it disappears and once it disappears I always increase it by one more and then adjust the threshold just so we get some of the the natural texture back that was in the photograph to begin with and the threshold of 11 seems to work right about here and click OK now here's the trick going in, into the history panel what we're going to do is we're going to take another photograph this time we're going to take a photograph of the layer and by a photograph I mean we're going to use this little camera to create a snapshot of the image just the way we have it right now. So I've created a snapshot and I'm going to make that active by clicking on this little box just to the left of my snapshot. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to go back one in history to where I just made the copy of uh, the layer above the background. And that brings us right back. Now if we go back into the layers palette where the dust is still there, so what do, what do we do now? So what we do is we go into the history brush and what we do is we change the mode from normal to darken. And then what we'll do is just paint away the dust all the dust just disappears what we're doing is we're painting back on from that snapshot that we took we're using that snapshot and we're painting that snapshot onto the layer that we presently have and I just wish I could clean my living room furniture this fast and this well and it looks like I've just about got all all the dust gone and I probably could have saved myself a lot of time and effort if I had just dusted the area that I was photographing in the first place so this is the the leaf and the background before we performed our photoshoptic surgery and this is after and that's it. Thank you.